Hi. Hello, everybody. Uh, we are back with some fresh, hot, daddy loves you, pokey will action. Um, Will's got to take care of something real quick, but so far, here's where we're at. Will has two badges. Um, I believe last time he got cut. He did not get cut, but he made it down to Vermilion City. I, I can't keep the names of these Pokemon places right, but... He's made so much progress. He's been training so hard. Look, I know that he can do it. He doesn't know that he can do it. Quite frankly, he may not do it. But I think tonight we can get two badges back to back, possibly. And I'm only saying that because that's what I did in my run. I came back and I did two badges back to back right around this part. We're playing Pokemon Fire Red. Uh, Will's playing Coffee Stain. We're going to be having a great time tonight on Pokemon. Who who knows what this boy is doing that is apparently more important, and he's currently hitting issues. Ain't that great? Um, Pokemon Fire Red. I've been playing it. Will's been playing it. We've all been playing it. It's a great time. I'm stalling here because I Will is literally playing Deep Rock Galactic right now. What the hell are you? He's he's sharing his screen with me and he's he's just said I'm going live stall and now he's just playing Deep Rock Galactic. Hi, everyone. What Welcome the to the modern era of video games. So uh, long story short, Karen, and I've been playing a lot of Deep Rock Galactic and she signs in on my computer and then uh, I don't think I'm muted anymore. Uh, anyway, she signs in on my computer and uh, she, we play together and then she signs out afterwards because she's good about that. But it didn't finish cloud syncing. So she went to go play with her friends and she didn't have her latest thing. So I had to sign in to make sure it synced with the unsynced and added the other thing to the cloud. So. <sighs> Anyways, we're here to play uh, what I like to call Pokemon. Uh, I'm going to switch over Pokemon. to the game here. Uh, so I haven't played too much uh, between the last episode. Uh, I did, I did get cut, um, because we got it from, oh, from the captain, from That's the right. captain of the SS and, uh, I taught it to, oh, let me click on the game. Okay. Uh, I taught it to. Oh, that's what I did. I tar I traded for a Farfetch'd, mostly so I had a Farfetch'd in my Pokedex. And then I taught it to that, and then I also looked up and I can just teach it to Barney. They said Nido, Nido King is one of the best slaves. So I'm just going to use him uh, for my HMTM slave stuff. Um, mm -hmm. So he knows cut. And then, uh, yeah, that's about it so far. Um... So next up, we have this electric gym, I believe it is. Um, I just want to double check. I did. Oh, I did catch it. I did go. Oh, yes. Hi, Kyle. Uh, I did go and catch a uh, Abra. Carbonara. Card yeah. named it Carbonaro. Uh, and I also caught a Oddish named it Cutie and oh look at how small it is that's fun. very small and i i caught a meowth i don't know if i had said that the last episode um so i think i'm all cut up on pokemon other than the ones that i can catch in like mount moon and stuff because i still haven't let's been do, able to go uh, back there uh I just, gym fights. yeah i just need to get i think geodude is good he's impervious to electric attack so if I remember correctly, I think I think you passed by two gyms to get to the boat. So I think you want to do the gyms north to south. If that makes sense. Okay. Wait, actually, I'm not sure. That may not be right. Let me check something real quick. I was reading, after I do this in the Diglett's Cave and go back, then I can use Cut to go to that other route and do a gym. Can I ask you a question? Why are you so obsessed with Diglett's Cave? I feel like every time I ask you, like, what's next? And you're like, Diglett's Cave. It's the only way back. Um, it's only because I want to go back and be able to access those areas. All right. Yeah. So let's do the Cerulean City Gym. 
Oh no, wait, you already, did you already beat Misty? Yes. Okay. So now you're going to do the Vermilion City Gym. Uh, sorry, I'm distracted. Will, do you want to guess what my project is? It's something we've talked about before, slightly. Actually, it's two things we've talked about before, but I'm combining them. Is it it's house-related, I'm assuming? It is not. It is not house-related? Um, are you... Are you... You're building it's something? A, it's a build yeah, project? Yes, this is... A, it's a terrible guessing game. Let me just tell you. Okay. Uh, <laughs> I want to guess. I, uh, I, so I was thinking about our, our game of the year stuff is going to rely on which games I have played in the past year. And I didn't keep a list of it this year, but because I think kind of in the local chat notes, I can have a rough list. Um, but the other thing is I wanted to start a gaming backlog of games that I want to play. Um, and so I was like, okay, what's the best way to do this? And I, you ever, do you know the website Notion? Notion.so? They're kind of like Airtable. Um, they do like database stuff. And I was like, well, I should make it in there. And then I was like, then I'm gonna have to go in and enter it. Like every time I wanna play a game, I have to open that website and I have to enter it. And I wanted like the name, the platform, the release date. And I have to look that up. And then I was like, well, it'd be easier if it was a form. Like if I just went to a form and I filled it out and it auto-populated the table, right? And then I was like, you know what would be bonkers? Is if all I had to do was say to one of my smart devices, hey, smart device, add Loop Hero to my gaming backlog and it automatically populated the database. And so I started working on that today. I think I'm about halfway done. I just got the Giant Bomb Wiki API working. So when I say a game name, it automatically goes to the Giant Bomb API and pulls the relevant information. And I have like web hooks. I'm like doing a Google Cloud like Python script in the in it's crazy. It's actually pretty easy once you get going, but I'm I'm excited about this project. Because we have both talked about our gaming backlog and doing stuff with the Giant Bomb API. And it turns out it's not that it's not that hard doing stuff with the Giant Bomb API. Just a bunch of JSON. Web request in JSON. JSON, Drew. Yeah, I um, I have a backlog. Actually, I haven't converted, so I converted everything from Giant Bomb lists to uh, um, in a Google Sheet. And so I I've copied over most of my gaming history to that, and I populate uh -huh. that myself. But I haven't updated the games I should probably play list, which is my my backlog list. Gotcha. Yeah, I just, I want to do a better job of keeping track of that, because I think it'll make me, I think it'll make end of the year stuff easier, you know? Yeah, I, a couple, when we started Subpixel, I started keeping track of games I played, either, uh, and not just new games, but every game I played in a year, so I was able to track that stuff easy, more easily. Yeah. I think I did it a couple of years ago, but it was just a list, and I kind of want to have my backlog, I want to be able to go into it and be like, show me all my DS games that I want to play. Yeah, yeah stuff like that. Yeah, so I like, I, yeah, so I can organize all my stuff by like review score, I gave it like release date, um, and then I have notes sections where I keep, nice. I don't do them as much anymore, but I used to do like day logs per game. That's cool. Bro, those rocks. Stop quick attacking me. No, 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 no. It's a good way to level up Rock Obama. Regular potions? Oh. For a 
lightweight. That's why he joined the gym. That's funny. Funny. Lock, lock, lock. Lock, lock, lock. Boltorb. Oh no, I think my brain just stopped for the day. Oh no. For the day, it's you think? It's been a long day. I, th I think so. I think it just... Died. Daddy dead. Hi, my name Daddy. And I'm dead. Sorry, Boltorb. Oh, thanks, um, Amanda underscore GFX for the retweet. Thanks. I, I did a tweet reply to uh, Nibel the other day, and uh, yeah. I'm sitting pretty at 70 likes. I think the most I've had was... I feel like I got a couple hundred from that one 3D printed runner stand. I want to say like 400. One, two, and poof. Rock Obama. Such a great name. Yeah, that was really good. Let's see what Magnitude does. Well, he missed. What does Magnitude do? Magnitude 7! Oh, that just kills it immediately. Oh, I love Magnitude. I've been using it a lot, honestly. Pop, pop! Great community reference there, everybody. Oh man, I I hated this gym, and I I think you're gonna you're gonna hit soon. Why? Is this one of like the puzzle ones? It is, but it's not really a puzzle. Hello, old man. I I'm gonna look up real quick. Um, because I or I want to see if this this one has a better oh only magnitude 5 I wonder what the highest okay. you can hit alright I've got I've got a tip for you when it comes to the puzzle because Magnitude six. You're doing good because this is this is the strategy that I used, and I believe and and the walkthrough says exactly this strategy. Use Geodude, you use Magnitude. Oh really? I just yeah. I, I saw it said because I didn't want to read ahead too much, but I just saw it said use a rock type, and I was like, oh, please, <laughs> Geodude. Yeah. Sixteen hundred dollars. Just put it in my fat fat fanny, sir. Okay. Lights in different colors are flashing on and off. Okay, good to know. Uh, and then this says lights. <gasps> thing. Nope, there's only trash here. <gasps> I'm trash. Hey, there's a switch. Turn it on. The first electric lock opens. Okay, so that's that one. Oh, that's gonna be so much fun. Wait, did it move? Oh boy. Excuse me? Oh, Gibbs. Oh. I was thinking oh, my right. name was yeah. Gibbs for a second. I was like, what? I thought it was talking about me. I was like, what? Okay, it's only trash. And for the sake of the stream, I'm going to tell you this. First electric the first switch. First switch moves around. The second switch is always next to the first switch. There you go. I I had to look that up because I was like, oh, okay, so it moves, and then I was like, are they both moving? But and I couldn't it, it's tell not until you look at. Is it randomly moving? It's it's randomly moving. That's dumb. 
both of them. I'm glad the you thing told me that, because I thought there was some sort of logic. Other. No, there's not a logic. The only quote-unquote logic is they're next to each other, so once you find the first one, just try one of the near ones. I figured it was something like that, because for you to not figure out a puzzle, I figured it was either something really stupid, like stupidly easy that you just missed, or it was yeah. something that you just is right. Magnitude 9, Voltorb, you are not going to enjoy this, buddy. Nope, you're just gone. Yeah, I was going to stream this yesterday, and then I had I had just enough work stuff that took me, like, till 5.30, and then I was still waiting for just the, like, feedback on a thing to make sure I didn't have to do <laughs> another version of it. And by that time, it was like six, and I was like, ah, I'm just gonna make dinner. Yeah. I, I'm glad I didn't commit to anything because I didn't even finish work till seven. <laughs> yeah. It's been kind of light this week because A, we've prepped a lot of stuff, uh, but also um, Game Awards is this week, so it's kind of just all hands on deck. Where? That, so. Yeah. Uh, no, it's just been a constant uh, fire at work. It's just some days there's more flames than others. And sometimes I have to help put the fire out, and sometimes I I get to just look at it. <laughs> and that dictates how, how long, how much I have to work. Oh, come on. It's, a... it's, it's just very weird because it's like... Things are bad at work, but also for me personally, it means that I have more responsibility and like input than ever. Like I am, I am designing a new telematics web service. Wow. <laughs> I know it's like, well, I guess it's just going to be me because I'm the only one that knows how the old, the current ones are working. So <laughs> it's just That's very crazy. weird. Yeah. So it's like good, bad. It's just, it's just things are weird. Oh, boy. Yo. Gross, you evolved your Pikachu? <laughs> it's disgusting. That's What's wrong with you? Jesus. Ugh. I forgot this game has, like, the baby Pokemon in it. And, like, breeding. I think breeding Pokemon is where they kind of crossed a line that I wish they didn't. They did that like immediately. Yeah. I don't I don't like that. We need to talk about Maggie's version of Pokemon. I got some I got some information from her. Okay, Excuse me. This. What does that mean? We we talked about it. What? Harvest Moon? Oh, 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 uh, oh, oh, sorry. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No potions. No. Okay, well here's the thing. Okay, so she told me the story. So she's got there's like five or six of her of her siblings total. And She's close with two of them, and what happened was, like, her older sister in high school got a Game Boy Color. And they really wanted to play it, and they were all, like, less than ten. And her older sister didn't want to share. So, long story short, her, her brother, and her sister, who are relatively close in age, got one old Game Boy with Pokemon Yellow. Oh, wow. And so they had to share, and they had to share the save file. And they had all these weird rules, like you're never allowed to run. You're not allowed to use any potions or items except for EXP share and antidote. Um, I forget, there were some other ones that were bonkers. Uh, oh, there's the 99 rule, which is um, after you beat the Elite Four, you have to get all your Pokemon to level 99. And then there was, this is less of a rule and more of a strategy, but the way she puts it is very disturbing. She, she keeps calling Ditto a slut because apparently if you put Ditto in the daycare with another Pokemon, it just lays an egg that is a better version of the original Pokemon, like with better stats. So she keeps being like, put that Put put that slut in the daycare. Yeah, because like, yeah, because Ditto's to. the one that can just change into anything. 
Yeah, so basically it just duplicates your current Pokemon with but with different stats, potentially better stats. Yeah. That's in so the way that's in the guide, in the breeding guide. <laughs> yeah, it's I mean I I know it's in there. I know it's not a special rule, but the way that she refers to it is a little disturbing. Um She also talked about how because you would put it down and somebody else would pick it up, you would get it and sometimes your Pokemon would be leveled or they would be swapped out. <laughs> so I was thinking I there's part of me. I'm not going to do this because I don't have the gumption. But there's part of me that wants to make... Oh, I forget what she called it. I think she called it, like, strict Asian Pokemon. And it would be a ROM hack of Pokemon with all these rules baked into it. <laughs> <laughs> and, and and she talked about how, one, how, like, if they had a Pokemon holding EXP share, but then somebody else put that Pokemon in the box, they had to go find which Pokemon it was. So part of the ROM hack is every time you load the game, there's like a 1% chance that EXP share is transferred to a random Pokemon in your box. Jeez. <laughs> and then like, you know, uh, if you save the game and load it, the longer that the game is dormant, the more your Pokemon will passively gain XP, but it's random. It'll be six random Pokemon, some in your party, some in your box, to like emulate somebody else picking up the game and playing it for you a little bit. <laughs> That's pretty good. I like that. Yeah, just all these really weird rules based off of their like little kid version of Pokemon. Yeah, just crazy. Cause that's why she keeps making fun of me. Cause like I'm using all these items and stuff, and she's like, "How dare you? How dare you?" How dare you? I'm just gonna switch. Oh, you got a badge, didn't you? Yes. Oh, you gotta update my peeps, too. Yeah, sorry, my brain's dead. That's okay. Alright. Let's do that. Well, go through this and then, um... Thunder badge. Youngster Dylan! Do you still have Pikachu? Yes. Uh, Pikachu, Wartortle, uh, Nidoran. Ge Geodude. Uh, Geodude. I have an Oddish. Spiro. Beedrill. And, uh, no, no Beedrill. Pidgey. Pidgeot. I think that's it, right? Oh, you're... you're... I think that is it. Yeah, Oddish instead of Beedrill, I think, is the only chance. Okay. Don't confuse me! <laughs> Sorry, youngster Dylan. Oh, other big update. Mm -hmm. I got a bike. Oh, that's great. I, I, there were later games where like it was a big deal that they mapped certain key items to a face button. And I was like, who, who cares? But then coming back to this game where you have to go into key items just to pull out the bike and other stuff is just like, oh, that was a big deal. <laughs> you know? Oh, thank God. I'm trying to think of the next Pokemon game I'm going to play. I think I'm going to play black or white. They're supposed to be very good. One of the one of the guys uh, at work on Twitter did a tier list of Pokemon games, and he had Heart Gold and Silver up. And I I heard I guess heard those good are things. Pretty good. I have Gold and Silver here for uh, the Game Boy Color. But is it aren't gold and silver the same Kanto region? Like I want a new region. Um, you know, I think it is a different because there's like seasons in Heart Gold and Silver. Black okay. and white were the first ones to introduce seasons. Seasons change everything. I don't know. <gasps> oh, it is you different. It's the Johto. Johto region. Yo, 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 yo. Seasons change. Seasons change everything. Like in Forza. Speaking of just a dud this year. Personal dud. Forza. 
personal dud here. Uh, Orza. Orza. at this point in the code where I'm like trying to convert in and out of JSON. It's just an absolute nightmare. I am using this cool website called replit.com and it's just a code editor online with a full console and everything so you just run it in the browser. Five more Pokemon so I can get this item finder. I guess it's gonna be blocked by Snorlax. <laughs> I think it's time for Diglett's cave, isn't it? Yeah, I just gotta finish this, uh... I ran past a bunch of people. <gasps> Found a great ball! Oh, I was not expecting the old man to fight. I could fit a bolt orb inside you. Excuse you? I bet they're like jawbreakers. Just pop them in your mouth. <laughs> it's inappropriate in so many ways. What? Dare confuse me. Oh, knew that was gonna happen. Absorb this man. Tired. Yeah? Yeah, I don't know, man. It's been a long week, it's only Tuesday. Oh, it's only man, I hate that you just said that to me. Vacation I this weekend it. though. Yeah, that is I, gonna I, be I, nice. I I know you're not, but I I took off Friday because I gotta travel. It's gonna be nice. Yeah, I um it'll be, it'll be busy. It'll be nice. I probably would have, but Karen can't, so it wouldn't have made sense at all. Yeah, that's good. I do have like four-ish hours to play with um, that I think I might just use to play Halo on Friday. <laughs> what time are you guys leaving? Uh, uh, Karen doesn't know if she can leave work early or not, so if she can, hopefully like around four, but not sure. Probably it'll probably be around oh, wow. 5:30. Yeah, that's still that still puts you there at 7:30. I probably won't get to the Airbnb until 6 6:30. Yeah. So it's not that not that long. Dude. 
Oh, this old man said he's never won before. Should I let him win? No, God no. I can die. Okay. Hi, are you a fire type? Hi, have you ever have you ever seen this cool water gun that just shoots water on your face and then you die? Oh yeah, it's really neat. Oh, you're gonna put out another fire Pokemon? Seems like a really bad idea. Is this Pokemon Naruto? It's got nine tails. It only has six heads. Unless you count the ones on its head. That's kinda nice. Uh. Hi, Halucha. No, I never watched the anime. I found it very annoying. I've been thinking about it. It was you telling me about how in wherever the F they can't say uh, gotta catch them all because it's licensing or it's uh, Sweden. Yeah, it's a tag. It's advertising directed advertising. at children. Which I, makes sense. I like that. Great, great. Thanks for a thousand dollars, bro. Did I get everyone? Did I do you? Excuse me. Gamer. Gamer Jasper. I oh. remember laughing at that when I saw it. I hate this guy is a bell sprout and I can't have a bell sprout. Although I'm glad I get an oddish. I gotta go back and check out on my Magikarp sitting at the nursery. Maybe he's a Gyarados already. Dig, let, dig, dig, let, dig. Trio, trio, trio. Is that how it sounded? That sounds probably like how it sounded. That sounds close. Yeah. Oh man, I was watching the Dragon Ball Z Kai and- um, Where are you at? Where are you at? I'm not far, I'm on episode like 18 or something. Um, they just beat uh, Vegeta and everyone. Oh, okay. Okay. Anyways, uh, oh, so uh, Krillin. Krillin, is that the bald guy? Krillin yeah. and Bulma and someone are on their way. Oh, and Go Gohan are on their way to Planet Namekian to see if they have more Dragon Balls so they can wish everyone back to life. But uh, yeah. Krillin has the sickest. Uh, how do the kids say it? Uh, 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 he's got a wet is that what they call it that he's got wet what do they call an outfit he's wet he's wet oh drip drip, drip. thank you <laughs> was God, so close oh <laughs> uh, krillin's got God, such that. drip that i just want to be under him i want him to drip on me um, did you hear that noise what noise it was like a duty oh, really? like a metal spoon oh was not me oh. Uh, oh. did you unplug a usb no, it wasn't that. It was, it was. I'm sorry to distract. I'm no, just... it's okay. Anyways, Krillin's drip 
uh, before they board the rocket ship uh, is I, I immediately searched to see where I could buy it. <laughs> is it the Hawaiian shirt one and the, and the glasses? No, let me look it up so you can. Uh... Oh, God, I know he's Krillin's Krillin great. Krillin's one of the best. Jacket. Easily one of the best. I always spell it wrong. Yeah. God, he looks so good. Oh, daddy good. Oh, his name, his name is on his hat too. Oh, it's so good. I need that. Uh, okay, let me send it work. to you. And then let me put it on stream so people can see it on stream. Actually, I can. Okay, brown. Down. Oh. Okay. okay. And then over here, we hit upload a file. We go double click that. And then enter, and I send it to Ian, and then I show it to that's, stream. That's that's what it is. It's the freaking Discord noise. They changed it. Did they? For the holidays. Oh. Yeah. No, I didn't. Oh. I think I turned it off. Oh, that's good. That's 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 a good hat, too. Yeah, it says his name on it. Oh, the jacket's so good. Oh, that's so good. They got to yeah. have it, right? I, I look for it everywhere. Someone on some subreddit that was looking for it was like, oh, you could modify a giant's jersey jacket like leather letterman jacket whatever they're called that's not um, bad that's not a bad idea i was like yeah i can see that you could just you could just find a bootleg one he's got some later on in the series he's got some real good stuff going on man do you think i should keep protect or learn protect and able to use to evade all attacks no. i don't care Now remember, folks. The one thing you need your square, your war turtle to learn is attack. <gasps> How dare you! Thank you, Bernie Sanders. You called me a spark plug. That seems rude. Okay, old man, I think you're literally the last person I need to fight. We didn't lose a draw! Gamer Hugo. <gasps> Polywag. Okay, alright, I've made progress. Okay. Maybe. I'm sorry I bit you. Done. Back to the pokey shop to heal up my pokey mans. Make them perfect. I hope to see you again too. I want to go check and see how much my magic card has grown. Fun fact, you can use the bike in the tunnel.
Hello. My magic carp has grown a lot. It's grown by eight. Aren't I great? You owe me $900 for it. Nah, you can keep it for now. See you, bud. I have not collected the Dragon Balls yet. Uh, save day the team. But they're on their oh, way to... You know what? Uh, Namekia. Namekia? Namek. To uh, get them in the show. Dragon Ball Z team training ROM is a fire red ROM hack that has uh, DBZ in it. That's <laughs> oh my God. I'm just, I'm sorry, I'm looking at a picture and it's the fight screen, but your Pokemon is Goku and it just says, what will Goku do? <laughs> <laughs> This is this is pretty good. We're finally here, folks. Diglett's cave. This is gonna be my Diglett cave uh, speed run. Uh, so You're gonna quit this game like, after this, comment, aren't you? and subscribe. All, all you've been talking about is this gosh darn Diglett boy. No, it's you not all I've been know. talking about. Is you kept arguing with me that I was wrong, yeah. and I was right. I'm just so, trying to remember. Is that really the only way back? It's yeah. funny because I played this last week, so can't even remember. Yeah, but you didn't you didn't have a need to backtrack, so you probably didn't notice. You know what I mean? Like I needed I to it, go back. Actually, you know what, now that you mention it, I think I backtracked after I got through Diglett's cave and I was like, oh, it put me here for a reason, so let me see if there's anything else to do here. And there really wasn't much. God. You ever see that picture of how <laughs> never mind. <laughs> I can't talk about this. <laughs> Uh, oh, I probably should have tried to catch you. That would have been the intelligent thing to do. Oh, well, I can ride my bike down here. That is great news. It means it's just faster to the encounters. Okay, Charmander, if, if you tackle, are you just going to murder him? Oh, <gasps> you perfect little beast. Excuse you. Can I wait? I guess I can tackle. I'll just miss. Ow. Ow, that did a lot of damage, you little jerk. Um, quick cue, uh, now that there's some Pokemon experts in the, uh, chat. When do I use Great Balls? Like, what, how do I know to use Great Balls? I, I, my minor experience is I am that asking the experts in the chat. And get great it. balls and ultra balls don't matter. It's only the master ball that you need to worry about because great balls and ultra balls you can buy in stores later on. Do I so want to I, give a nickname to Diglett? I got to this point where I was like, I'm going to throw a Pokeball at this thing and it's like being a jerk. And I'm like, fine, I'm going to throw a great ball at you. You know? So it's just a matter of money with great balls and ultra balls. Master ball, I believe there's only one though. I'm not sure about that. And, and Holucha has the right. It's It has a higher catch rate. That's why it's a better Pokemon. Gotcha. Karen and I have been doing this joke, and I don't know how it started, but it was Cowboys, instead of saying yeehaw, they say peehaw! <laughs> <laughs> and it devolved into me being like, hi, yes, I'd like to order two yeehaws and a peehaw, please. Jeez. Anyways. My name is peehaw. You only get one master ball. Oh, sorry, not to uh, divert, interrupt myself. Um, I already looked up cheating in this game because, uh, and not in the way you think, but there were sp special events for this game and you can, you can't, you had to go to like a Toys R Us or a Best Buy to connect with a Pokemon rep so you could get access, you could get a ticket for the ferry to go to these special islands. Uh, and obviously you can't do that anymore because Toys R Us doesn't exist and neither do the events. So you have to, you can use the cheat system in Visual Boy Advance or a Game Shark to warp yourself there. Or you can straight up edit the game code to make a one of the uh, shops sell the ticket to you for free. Wait, but stuff. what was the ticket? The ticket was with the game. How would they scan the ticket Game Boy camera? No, so you, 
I think the Game Boy rep took your game, plugged it in, it uploaded whatever it had to it, and then they handed it back to you. Oh, that's bonkers. Uh, honestly, if anyone in the chat that's has ever crazy. done it, because I used to do people who did that for the 3DS games, but I don't know how it worked way back before that. But I, I was going to say, I wonder if this game lets you print out the... Can't you print out your, like, thing at the very end? I thought that was a thing in Pokemon. You could, like, print like out your, your trainer card trainer or card something. Or something. Like I want to buy a Game Boy printer and print it out. Uh, I don't need another Diglett. Diglett? Dig. about a repel. How long is this cave? <laughs> Arena trap. So literally this Diglett just wants to die. Do 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 sweet item find ooh free house Uh no I still hate Pokemon it's terrible That's not true Should I tr Oh I need to go get another Abra so I can trade it for a Mr. Mime yeah, One of might as well pack up that. We'll just put the put it in the uh, training. Put it in the thingy with the ditto. I couldn't bring myself to say the word. I'm not gonna say the word. I'm not manicky. Oh, with the slut. I can't throw that word. Oh. Do you not like the word slut? Oh. I no, I don't. I think I think I've. I you know every now and then you come around to a word and you go, you know what? Maybe that is inappropriate. And I think I think it is. What about whore? See that one I'm I'm troubled about because there's a character. <laughs> there's a <laughs> there's a character in the Sopranos who goes hua hua. <laughs> That's how we pronounce it. Oh. Hua. I was gonna say there's a character in like, Always hua. Sunny who says hua. <laughs> I wonder if it's a callback. Hi, remember me. I'm one of Professor Oak's aides. If you poke this, <laughs> complete data. Just... I do. Give it to me. Yes. I'm dying. Three, 26. Yeah. Dude. He gave me aid. <laughs> oh, no. He gave me flash. <laughs> Sorry. You did not give me that. Jeez. Oh, thanks for flashing me, dude. Do, 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 well, that was do, one of your do, friend's do, nicknames do, do, do. in high school. Nice. Nice. Just find it all sorts of shit. I cut into these little things. Oh, I wonder if I can find special Pokemon in here. Oh. My offline time is going to be so great now that I can just get Pokemon. Oh, God, this, this is, is just up here. Just oh. Complicated. Oh, so lovely. I wish I don't know why when you cut down a tree it can't stay cut down. What? 
gross. Zach, why do you want to know if this p person's a virgin? It's disgusting. Wrong. Oh yeah, can't can I do this gym now? Is old man gonna move? Zach's always on the lookout for virgin. <laughs> Hey, uh, you know any, uh, virgin? Hey. Oh, I'm not virgin shaming. I'm shaming you for your weird attraction <laughs> to virgins. <laughs> that makes sense that time you texted me to ask me if I knew any virgins. Wow, two girlfriends. Yeah, it's, with Zach, it's always Fortnite. <laughs> That's all he talks about. And microtransactions. Jeez. Y'all hey, got what, problems. What is the point of this? Why did I cut this what? down? What? What? It, it probably just lets you scoop by some trainers. No, it doesn't. It's a town. Oh, I'm so happy I can come back. Oh, let's go this way. Is this the Elite Four, is it? Um, Zach, I think you're uh, alleging to when I did a bit in local chat about you being a racist. And I actually wasn't referring to you. I said the man who wrote that song was a racist. So if you're claiming to be the person who wrote that song, then I guess they're, I mean, if the shoe fits. You performed the song, I know that much. If you're saying you wrote it, then um, Pokemon League Gym, I should not well, go to, correct? He didn't. Here's how we know he didn't. Because on a recent episode, it was just Zach and I. And when we had Zach on to play the theme song on that episode with Zach, somebody else joined the Discord call. Wow. Played the theme song and then left. Oh, like, if you wild. listen to the recording, you can hear somebody join the call and then leave after the theme song, which means it's not that Zach. That's all I'm saying. The person? <gasps> no, give us your Twitch Prime sub. <laughs> <laughs> we need that $2.99 per month. Actually, I think it may be even less yeah, than that. I'm a slut for that. <laughs> I'm a ditto. <laughs> I'm a ditto for that. Look at that ditto. <laughs> oh. That ditto is a bad idea. With a lot of men. <laughs> Don't be such a ditto. <laughs> Wait, where am, I supposed, where am I supposed to go? Hey, I was thinking about extra life. Should we not do it? I, I, I think I'm willing to do the tattoo thing all over again. Same amount. Yeah, that's fine with me. We're never going to get that. All much. right. 2022 if we raise ten thousand dollars on extra life between us and save data i will get a sub pixel tattoo there it is i said it ian said it i did not um no i'll get a tattoo um what am i doing where am i supposed to go next check this uh, it's it's, it's not where you think it is aka who cares about diglets? Uh, you gotta go to the rock tunnel. Where's the rock tunnel? Um, oh, that's, where, uh, that's where I was trying to go. It's on the map. Check the map. I don't have a I think, map. I think it's, I think it's top right. We well, don't have a map, go to your bag. Go to key, key items. Okay, you need to go back to like the first or second city. Tap buy a map? And go get the map. No, you just talk to somebody, they give it to you. Hi. Yeah, it's, they're in the house. Just talk to... I feel like if you talk to somebody, they're like, My sister's obsessed with that map, but she'd never give it away. And then you talk to her and she's like, Hey, here's a map for you. My sister's a slut for that map. <laughs> Such a ditto. A town map. Hey, look at that. No, that's on the mall. 
It's on the wall. <laughs> it's on the mall? Excuse me? It's on the mall. It's on the National Mall. Allotown. Cinnabar? Mmm, Cinnabar. I just want to go oh, and look at this town now. Please. Mount Moon, Cerulean City, Saffron. Oh, so I have to go. Oh, I know what I I messed up. I was I was being a stupid. Hi, excuse me. Okay, sure you should go get a you, sh board. you should go get a town map though. Yeah, can you just tell me where to do that? It's it's in one of the houses. Well, I I I, I, I if I wanted to spend an hour looking for it, I could, <sighs> or I could clearly ask my co-host to stop Daisy what he's Oak, doing. Daisy Oak will give it to the player after the player receives a starter Pokemon. Who's Daisy Oak? Daisy, okay, give me a goddamn minute. I feel like- Daisy Oak. Listen, I let you get away with not paying attention to these streams, but when I need you to pay attention- She's probably, she's probably need you in to the pay original. Attention. What do you mean in the original? She's in my mom. The my first, mom's the original. The first town. Yeah. First town. Okay, I just wanted to know what house. You weren't the laziest no, man the alive. Man. You weren't the yeah, laziest it, it, human being. How? How am I lazy? If you're the one that can't even talk to every gosh darn NPC in a gosh darn JRPG, what do you think you're supposed because to do 99% of the time when you're playing these games? I didn't know. This game is not an RPG, first of all. It is a JRPG. It is not a JRPG. 100% a JRPG. Pokemon is not a JRPG. Halucha, Zach, I need you on my side here. Is Pokemon a JRPG? Pokemon is not a JRPG. What is it then? It's a monster it's, fighting it's game. A, it's a pocket monster game. Yeah, it's its own thing. <laughs> baby's first JRPG. I'll show you Baby's first JRPG. That, yeah, I, I accept that. Yeah, but it's not a JRPG. It is a JRPG. No, it isn't. It is, what a, how is it not? Okay, we're gonna stop fighting because you're wrong. It has no uh, uh, Look, Halucha's got a very good point. They don't want to agree with me and yet they are forced to. <laughs> um, seriously though, what makes you think it's not a JRPG? Like, is there just... some visceral gut reaction that you don't want to say that? No, it's just like, it's, I, I feel like a JRPG, like, y you, I mean, I can understand it has JRPG elements, but I wouldn't put it on a list of the best JRPGs. Well, that's not necessarily what I'm, but it should be on that list, but I think it fits that better than any other. Yeah, I just, Genre. like, to me, a JRPG is like, you're the main character, and the main character does stuff with a party of peers, versus this, you are the main character, but you don't do anything, you're Pokemon, you're controlling. So, my character is playing a JRPG, but I am not playing a JRPG. I'm playing a game where I play a person who's playing a JRPG. <sighs> Anyways, I gotta go, uh, to this rock temple. Oh, I should have bought some repels. It was a logic journey, and I'm glad you were there with me. Oh, zoom beanies, make me a pizza. Oh, what? Dude, we need a zoom beanies stream. Make me a zoom. pizza. What's Zoom Beanies? Oh man, do you? Oh, you're missing out. You're ready to get your butt tickled. Zoom Beanies with an actual pizza would be awesome. Uh. That's like the, I, there, I know there's other games in Zoom Beanies, so it's literally the only one I remember. <laughs> Also, the other, like, kids game that I knew, I, I know, uh, I know, like, table settings from, I think it was Pajama Sam, that, where you had to learn etiquette, and then, uh, there was a putt-putt game, and I'll always remember this, because the putt-putt goes to the tire, and he's like, hey, I need to go down this river, and the tire says, shall we, and putt-putt goes, putt-putt says, let's shall, 
and I've always thought that sounded so stupid, but I always say it now when people say, shall we? And I go, let's shall. <laughs> I don't even know if it's proper English. I don't think I ever saw Zumbinis. Um, I did Math Blaster. Math Blaster's great. I have um, some of those CDs did, somewhere. Do you ever play any of the Dr. Brain games, like Island of Dr. Brain, Castle of Dr. Brain? I love those games. So stupid. Oh, I really wish I had a map. Yeah, maybe we should do like a like a a preschool series where we just play games from our. Are you smarter than a preschooler? Nailed it. <laughs> we have to beat the game. It can't be that hard to beat these games, though. But also, yeah. I have $35,000. Ah, ma'am, I will pay the $50 for a child's ticket. <laughs> I think this is the point in the game where I was like, is that is that a lot? That sounds like a lot. And then I looked it up and they were like, Poke dollars are basically yen. So that's 50 cents. And I was like, oh, okay. Okay, Hi. that's pretty cheap. We've been over. I Hi, um, I have an incredibly rare fossil that I would like to show to someone. Is there anyone here who would like to see this incredibly rare fossil that I have procured from... I thought maybe someone here... I'm trying to use my, my JRPG intuition and come to a place where I thought maybe... Someone would want to see this, but I guess. <gasps> can I can I talk to that scientist? Cause he's kind of he's kind of just back there. Oh look! Oh, <gasps> fuck you! Yeah. Fucking right, bitch. Language. Sorry. Slut. <laughs> Ditto. Ditto. Uh. Hi, nerd. You looking at porn? Me? No, this guy on the computer. Should I teach Seismic Toss to one of my Pokemon? Sure. Um. Should I teach it to Rock Obama or to Pikachu? Or to what is it? Rock Charming? Toss? No, Seismic Butt something. I'm listening oh. to Halucha. Halucha trusts me now. I, I trust Halucha. I fly on the wings of Halucha. Pikachu? Really? I think that's who I taught Pikachu. I mean, Pikachu doesn't need that dumb move that Pikachu Actually, has. Actually, yeah, I like that. And here's why I like that. Ready? Because, oh, no, wait. It's a fight move. Gravity-fed throw that causes damage matching you based on your level. Yeah, you could teach it to your Pidgeot. So here's my logic, here's my logic. Let me run through this real quick. I like the idea of your Pidgeot is flying. So it's, it's if you put your flying against another flying, then you're not gonna take much damage, but you have an anti-flying move. Oh no, fight is not anti-flying. I always forget that. I'm just gonna replace slam. I, uh, Halucha, what I'm trying to describe is I'm trying to describe a situation in which your Pokemon is not vulnerable to who you're facing, but the move that your Pokemon has is very effective. I, also, against I don't them. think Fat Bird could learn it. That's fair. I was getting it wrong anyways. Fighting and flying is one of those things that I constantly get backwards. It's fighting is weak to flying, but I always think of it as like, if you're a fighter and you do like an upper punch or you could like do a jump kick, then you could hit flying things. But that is not how the logic works in Pokemon. <laughs> this guy just I gave me some amber. I I feel like I am slowly starting to get Pokemon strategy, like what moves are preferable for which types. But it's still a bit of a brain twister for me. Thanks, babies. Okay, who's in this? Hi. Um, question, sir, where do you sleep? Um, 
Okay, I did that. Notice, these have been seen in Pokemon. Okay. Route three. Is this the right way? Or is it? Let me get my bike. Excuse me. Are there any more cuts around here? This is... I should talk to the guy because he gives me a magic card. I already caught one, so... Thank you. I'm gonna put... This lure? Oh. I feel like that's accurate. I'm struggling over here. Yeah, struggle bus? Zach's asking how the new job is. Oh, it's great. Yeah, having a lot of fun. Uh, a lot of editing. Uh, but it was cool. I, I got to participate in the game of the year and games of the year discussions and everything. That was really fun. Uh, I got to do Extra Life with them. Uh, played some... Um, what did I play? Mario Party. And then, uh, yeah. Yeah, it's been fun. It's a good job. And I hopefully get to go work in an office now. Um... Oh. In uh, January. Nice. That sounds like fun. Yeah. Hi, can I absorb you, please? Oh, you're gonna give it to me first. Uh, yeah, in NYC. Uh, I don't know exactly where the office will be. No one's really told me. Mostly because the headquarters are in San Francisco, so I just have to wait for like my direct boss to know things. Yeah. Or my manager, I should say. No, not going to Cali. I mean, I could... It depends. If I stay there for a long time, I could... I could see myself moving out there, but... Not really. No part of me that is like, yeah, I want to move across the country. <laughs> I was about to say it's too expensive, but you live in New York, so it's too expensive already. Yeah, it's true. It's up Pixel West. True. Uh, I will say it. No promises, but we are going to try and do a Pixel 8 Los Angeles. Probably in uh, the second weekend of June. <laughs> <laughs> Probably. I I mean I guess I'd probably be out there. I you can can't get, imagine. You can get one. I I would apply through Subpixel, which is a maybe. But at the same time I could just buy it. They have it open to the public now, so uh TwitchCon in San Diego. That sounds like I it's kinda like the people who do videos where they visit a porn convention like I would only go to TwitchCon just to be like look at all these weirdos and fake celebrities you know <laughs> I would totally do that the other thing I uh, I'm just gonna throw it out here now I think we're gonna submit some panels for PAX East I feel like at a minimum the the greats which is our PowerPoint debate show and uh mini game game show would both work really well as a PAX panel um so I'll probably submit those. That'd be a lot of fun. I feel like I'm taking the long way back to where I was. Seems like a mistake.
<laughs> Thanks. I'm trying 100%. to spread the wealth. See you. Uh, I don't think. I don't remember this at all. Should have bought a repel. I hate Zubat so much. Struggling over here. Struggle bus? Apparently, my JSON is actually a dictionary of lists. Is that good? What a nightmare. It's just like one of those things where you're like, give me this value, and they're like, no, wrong type. Give me this value. No, you gotta tell me the index. It just, it's just like, what? I basically needed to take this giant JSON response and like pull one little piece out of it, but I'm having trouble telling it, get this piece. I got it. Yay, we got it, folks. I, finally, I basically called an API and it said, tell me what the release date of Loop Hero is, and it gave it back to me. Nice. Dear, dear Lord, that took a while. Okay, all right, so then I can do, I can do this, which is to say, So how do you look at your list? Where does it populate the text? 
Uh, sorry, what do you mean? Like, if you want to, like, look at your list of games that you are in your backlog, like, where do you go to see that? Oh, I go to, um... Sorry, one second. No, that's fine. Wait, oh, I thought it was um, nice. I, I go to Notion. It's it's like Airtable. It's just a little bit more dynamic. Like Airtable oh, so is very it, it focused fills on Notion with it. Yeah, it fills yeah. Notion with it. And Notion's Notion's just more like you know, Airtable is all about like you have a table of data, and then we have different ways of displaying it. Notion is more like it's almost like a wiki. <gasps> like you have different ways Ooh. of displaying stuff. So um, I'm using it's basically just populating it in Notion, so I can always go to Notion and see a nice table. So that worked. What is going to hurt the fairy the least? Halucha, if you're I don't there, know. Do you know. That's one of those Pokemon that I just don't know. I want to capture this Clefairy. I just want to know what's going to hurt it the least so I don't kill it. Don't kick it. Should I cut it or should I peck it? Oh, jeez. Now here comes the complicated one. Oh, okay. Thank you, Halucha. Wow. I have to get a list of platforms. Yeah. The fairy is mine. Pelucha, do you want a nickname Clefairy? I feel like a uh, little Pokemon... I like dance to this, like parade to this. Clef. 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 How do you pronounce that? Yeah, is this trying to get me to say something horrible? Clef Saho? Is that what it is? Clef Saho. Yeah, okay, that's is. what I thought it was. I just wanted to make sure it wasn't some horrible thing. You could help? just put. Oh, I guess there is no apostrophe, but you could just put. You could just have it be Clef's a ho. But you know what? Halucha's wishes. Yeah. Yo, Clef's a ho. <laughs> Hello, science man. Oh, one more before we leave. so much better in this baby boy. Dummy must daddy Yankee. Oh, dummy must daddy Yankee. Oops. 
getting better at Python. Tell you what, Python is so much better than C++. Just a lot more legible. I still want to learn a programming language at some point. There's, um... There's crazy good websites where they're, you just do it in the browser and they're just like, here's your tutorial, now do it. And I've even seen yeah. there's there's YouTube sites. Well, there's there's like professional, there's like, you know, Udemy and stuff that have courses, but there's also free courses. But they, they tie into one of those browser platforms, pl browser code editors. So as you're doing the course, it's just like, okay, now go do lesson one. And then you just load up lesson one in your browser instead of having to like download a text file and do all that, so. Yeah, I, I followed one for a while for website stuff a couple years ago, which was pretty good. My, uh, the company, parent company does, I, I, like I gotta figure out what the levels are, but like the highest level of it is, I don't know if I've described this before, but they, um, like if you go to them and sign up for the class, you're like, hey, I wanna learn a programming language. And basically it's like a career change, so they'll like, it's like a night school for learning a diff like programming and engineering and all that sort of stuff. And then, so I think mm -hmm. it's six months of that. And then at the end of that six months, you join the, and you switch to the engineering team of wherever in the company. And then you have six months of onboard training, joining that com that team. And then after that six months, you're just hired on that team with whatever pay and everything. Like you're just, they just transition you. And that's just, if you want to learn oh, that nice. instead of, uh, what you're currently doing. I think that's really neat. Yeah. I, like, I don't want to go that... Like, I like what I do, so I wouldn't want to go that yeah. far. So I want to know if I can just be like, hey, I want to take this class and learn all this stuff. Uh, well, one, thing you, one thing you could do, I don't know if your job offers it, my company's offered it for a couple of years now, is um, uh, Udemy is one of those online platforms that has a bunch of classes. Everybody in the company has a Udemy license. So, like, I learned CAD and Autodesk Confusion 360 from those, because you just go in there and there's a giant library of stuff. So it wasn't even related to my work, but I was just like, I want to learn how to use CAD. And there are all these courses you could take. That's like, cool. I even took one on, um, I started it, but I didn't finish it, but it was on um, After Effects, because I know nothing about After Effects, and it was just stuff like that. I have a couple, I bought a bunch of classes on Udemy when they were having a sale a couple years ago. I need to like, Go check in on them. Gotcha. Because I had a couple, like, I had one for, like, pixel art. I bought one, was like, oh, here's one to do 2D Unity. Here's one to do 3D Unity. Here's one yeah. to do. Uh, and also, actually, another one I really enjoyed outside of all of this is the uh, roguelike tutorial on the roguelike subreddit. Because uh, mm -hmm. I genuinely, I like, I built a game that runs in command prompt, which is really cool. Sent me. Oh, that's not what I want. Nice. Okay. All right. I I I don't want to jinx it, but I believe the giant bomb portion of this is done. So I basically have it automatically call giant bomb and get the list of platforms in the release date. Jeff Gersman gets a call. <laughs> Just, oh, what's the game? Loop Hero. Came out, I don't know, like 2021 or something. <laughs> Fans of the genre. They're mixed bag. How many Pokemon do you have, lady? What's good against grass thing? I'm oh, just gonna wash them all away, I guess. Bite them to death. Oh, it's probably. Ooh. 
Hiker Jeremy. Chop. Uh, Halucha said you should play uh, Dream Daddy with your daddy hat on. I saw that. I was trying to ignore it. Uh... It's pretty good. It's pretty good. Sorry, Hiker Jeremy. My Pokemon good look. something out. See if this webhook works. It's not the full thing, but it's pretty good. Um. Hey, Google. Oh, I haven't turned on here. One sec. Gosh darn it. Pokemon Fire Red to my gaming backlog. Okay, that worked. Okay, so that, that came in. So basically me saying that sent it to a webhook I have. Nice. So now I need to... String to a JSON.
Bug catcher, Bran. E drill. That worked right away. So what I did was, uh, I'm a little cheating right now because I said Pokemon Fire Red and that sent it to my webhook and then I just copied what my webhook received and put it into my program and it spit out Pokemon Fire Red release date 2004-907 platform GBA. Nice. So it's working. I just need to like get the individual parts up so that they're actually fully connected. I, I basically have a Python script that's going to have to live in the cloud that things are going to feed into and feed out of. And apparently you can do that with Google Cloud for basically free. Like as long as you don't call it more than four million times in a month, then it's free. So four million times. Yeah. Anyone good? Nope. It's Bureau. How are you doing? Are you still going through Rock Cave? Did you finish that? Uh, I so I went the that was Mount Moon. I went the long way back here. Um, no, I mean, well, sorry, I'm, I have. I'm headed to but... Rock Tunnel right now. Okay, gotcha. gotcha. Rock Tunnel took me a while. First time I did it, it was a pain. But according to this wiki, you are about third of the way through. Pokemons. Noice. Actually, that's not true. You're... Well, you still have a decent number of badges. Let's say a third of the way through. Like you to heal my Pokemon, please. Oh, that's fine. 
Is it just because they couldn't store the information that they don't... Why do they make you cut it every single time? I, don't get I think they're just not storing the information, would be my guess. Stupid. Stupid and I hate it. Which way should I go? That way or should I go this way? Do 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 Man, this is fun. Like I don't wanna be a programmer in real life, but being able to build little stupid little things like this to serve a one-off purpose is fun. Yeah, that's like the one thing I wanted to learn because even like my Excel stuff or not Excel. Um, I don't know why I put a flying type against a rock type, but it's just where we are today. I do that because sometimes I get mixed up and I go, oh, it's flying. It's off the ground. Yeah. But it's like, well, no, but if well, it hits the ground. Also, Halucha got in my head and I want to not use Charmander as much, but it's a literal rock type. So I have to use Charmander. <laughs> Um, let me just water gun him, please. Uh, it's that kind of stuff, like, I, I want to be able to take all the data I have, and I know this is possible inside Google Sheets, and just have, like, graphs and stuff of all, like, so I can better visualize it. Like, that stuff I don't even know. And, and like, the API stuff you're doing would be cool to know, because for Weir's, Will's, Will's Weird Games, I wanted to be able to have the game I was playing auto-populate on the screen like with text yeah. boxes like fill everything out which you could totally I mean I mean I I figured out the giant bomb API so I could totally help you with that I mean honestly it, the big rock was it was returning it in JSON and JSON can be complicated because you the program doesn't read it as JSON it converts it to something and in this case it was a dictionary of lists of dictionaries <laughs> so it's just like how do I tell it to get this and it's yeah. like, well, you got to do a dictionary list, dictionary call. It's like, blah, blah, blah. Thanks, Hiker Allen. Glad I came here for a burn heel. My favorite USA show, Burn Heel. Starring... Bruce Campbell. Great. My bird Pokemon was just murdered. So if I could have a moment, what's good against, uh, you have Peck, so you're going to be fine. Yeah, flying's going to get stuck. It's a, yeah, it's flying. Touching me. I wish when I pecked the Pokemon and the Pokemon is also poisoned, it said it did all of the damage and it said this Pokemon was pecked and had poison damage. It's dead now. Instead of doing it separately. I hear it, yeah. It just takes forever. Everything takes forever. No, I don't know what a Vino Nat is, but... Oh! oh! That is the most disgusting Pokemon. It's so... It's like a fly's head. It's like a Mankey had sex with that other bug we saw last time. Oh, it's so gross. I I don't like bugs. 
And it looks like a fly. It looks like Jeff Goldblum. The fly. Whoops. Yes, in real life, it, I can... I can... Um, I can agree with you there. It looks cute like this, but when I think about real life applications and how that fuzz is just like fly whiskers and those eyes are just millions of eyes staring at you. Ugh, of course it hurts. So stupid idiot. Stop confusing my Pokemon. Ugh. Okay, rocks crush bugs, right? We've all, we've all known that. Honestly, don't know. Do not poison me. Do not poison a rock. Rocks can't be poisoned. They're made of rocks. Yeah, you're They're fine. Made of rocks. I like, I like this because I have a lot of the same moves in Pokemon you have, but I turned off all the battle animations because it's taking too long. So watching this, I'm like, oh, that's what rock throw looks like. I don't mind the battle animations, it's the text animations are stupid. Just like total, total the damage. Oh. Weedle. I'm gonna point. They got Marty Poison Bud. Uh, does Rock Obama need to learn self-destruct? Alucha in with the save. These are blows up to inflict severe damage, even making himself faint. Did I get rid of Mud Sport? Mud Squirt? Get rid of Mud Sport. Thank you. Yeah, I subscribe. Uh, what wiki do you use for uh, for your Pokemon playthrough? I use the Saint Halucha. Do you use that one? It's great. Just go to twitch.tv slash pop out chat and uh, you just ask it questions. It just answers them perfectly. It's the best wiki. Oh. Oh, frick yeah. Yeah, you are. We need that sweet Barney song we heard that one time. Roblox. Oh, you're so cool. Yes. Nidorino. <laughs> that sounds like a like a kid uh, kid nickname. Hey there, Nidorino. How's it going, my man? You know? Oh, 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 everyone's being poisoned. Here we go. Like Buckarino. Barack Obama. Barack Obama. Can you check your Discord, oh. please? You should buy that. I, I gotta look up. How much is a redirect? Is a redirect free? I think so. That's a good idea. It is free. God, nice shorts, bro. Let me, let me, let me check. Let me check something. Zigzagoon. Twelve dollars a year. It's not bad. No, I'm gonna sort by price. Cheapest is. Oh, but you know what? You know what I am gonna try. Cheaper. Rude. 
Should I? I I feel like I should. Do it, girl. Do you think that's you think that's a funny enough joke? How much? How much is it? It's twelve dollars a year. Yeah, I'll split it. I'll split it. With you. Okay, I'm doing it. Know what you do? Uh, actually, never. Mind. You do. You do. You. Turning off auto renew. Smart. After he learns horn attack. Okay. Uh, where should it where should it go? <laughs> you should say therapy. To what? What's Cerebi? Uh, I'm redirecting it. Right. Or Bulbapedia. I was going to redirect it to that uh, strategy wiki one I was using. Oh, actually, that's that's a good idea. I'll do that. Actually, she just redirected the Twitch. Oh, I see. After it evolves, it won't learn anything. So what happens. You evolve, and then you just can't learn anything else. Can't teach a new evolution, old tricks. That's right, you can't measure up. I wonder who's in there. Did I fight you already, lady? Yeah. Did I fight that lady? Stand by. Uh -oh. Route 10. It's not not quite up yet. It's trying. Whoa. We're going to give it a little bit. Okay. I think I'm going to probably wrap up. Uh, I'm not going to go into Rock Cave because I don't want to start it now and not be able to get anywhere. Plus, I have plenty of areas to uh, collect stuff. Okay. I'm just going to talk to you. We have to stall. We have to stall a little bit for this joke. No, that's fine. Focus. It's not quite there yet. Let's give you a reward. Maybe go check the marts. See if they've got some uh, upgraded stuff you want to buy. I got an Everstone. Thanks, dude. Heidi, picnic or Heidi, Pikachu. I'm gonna poison you. So, what are your goals for for next time? It looks like uh, I'm just taking a look at the, the wiki. Looks like def definitely rock tunnel, and then uh, lavender town. I think you can do Celadon City next time. You think? And after that, we'll hit up some gyms. Yeah, feeling pretty good. Um, if you want to wrap it up, we can wrap it up. This may take a while. Yeah, that's fine. I'm just gonna... Uh, I just want to finish this fight. Ow. Master Chief said, finish that fight.
type is clipping me. I need to look that up. In my Pokedex. Don't make me go to sleep, please. Fapper's eyes are clearly open. Cool. Oh, cut off. No, it did not. Oh, don't fall in love with Clefairy, please. Man, I was just thinking, this is actually a cool integration where I, I could repurpose this and have it be like a shopping list, but you would say things like, add milk to my shopping list and it would go out and hit let's say like walmart target winn dixie and Publix, and grab their price for milk assuming they have a website you know like walmart does and then just automatically add it to your shopping list and say the price and uh which location it was that had the lowest price like which store it's because the same basic framework i'm doing now Yeah, APIs are cool, man. Let's get them going. 11 hours in, folks. 28 Pokemon. I'm going to catch a bunch between now and the next stream. Um, folks, our next stream uh, will not be live, so it won't be a stream. But uh, game, uh, I'm going to put this probably out Thursday morning will be the next episode of Local Chat. It will be Game Awards Predictions and all sorts of stuff. Or maybe I'll just have it premiere Wednesday night. I don't know what I'm going to do. Um, so we're going to yes. record that tomorrow and talk through that. It'll be me, Ian, and Kyle. So that should be fun. Um, uh, real quick, though. Um, is this working? I, I, do have, I do have something. Can you, can you pull up a browser? Oh, yes, I can do that. Uh, you mean in uh, a browser source in? Uh, no, just pull up a browser window. I need you to type in a URL live on stream. I think that's the best way to do it. Okay. Oh, I see. What... I can capture. That's even easier. Um, I was going about it the complicated way. And when you have it up and running, if you could, um, if you could go to www oh you're not ready yet nope okay now it's there okay if you go to www.sainthalucha.com that should take you to uh the best pokemon www.sainthalucha.com and i hit enter that's right Oh, it brings me the strategy wiki for Pokemon Fire and Leaf Green. That's incredible. Perfect. Exactly what you need. It's this. I just wanted to do this real quick because Halucha, God forbid you never make it to one of these streams. We we still need your guide. So <laughs> that's perfect. That means I can just, uh, you know, can you write a can you write a Google command so I can say, hey, Google, uh, help me with yeah. Pokemon. <laughs> it goes to St. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, that's great. Um, I will say, Lucha, if you want that redirected anywhere else, I'm more than happy to do that for you. <laughs> no, but I'll type it in and it'll be something else. And I'll be really confused in Pokemon. <laughs> yeah, you got to wait till PokeWill's done. And then we'll redirect it somewhere else. <laughs> oh, that's fantastic. That's so good. I had to do it. It was too easy. I, honestly, I'm surprised it updated that quickly, though. Normally, it takes forever for those web changes to turn around with domains. Yeah, that was good. Uh, anyways, folks, thank you so much. Uh, and by folks, I mean Halucha and Zach. Thank you for watching. Thank you for tuning in. Uh, we'll be back um, not this weekend because we'll be in Philly for PAX Unplugged. It's going to be a good time. But next Tuesday, more Pokey Will. So tune in for that. Um, and then the next... Uh, I don't know. I'm not going to get into this it's right now. Tuesday. I I think think it's Tuesday. It's Tuesday, right? No, no. I was going to get into the next local chats and everything but i'll talk about that on local chat because that's when local chat is yeah uh anyways folks thank you for watching uh and we will see you all in the next millennia no we'll see you next week bye bye